We have a personal, a personal question to you. That uh, you said there's a clip on YouTube that says that you left uh, Salafia and you don't follow the Salaf anymore. Could you please elaborate what you actually meant in that uh, video clip? Uh, so firstly, listen to the clip carefully. Don't listen to it third hand. Somebody said that my friend said that my uncle said that my cousin heard. Listen to it fully in its context. Secondly, Ayah Astaghfirullah never said that I left the way of the Salaf. The way of the Salaf is the most orthodox and the best way of understanding Islam. Our Prophet ﷺ has praised the three generations. However, this is a technical and deep question and it is not meant for those who are not aware of these movements. Nonetheless, it has been asked, so I will say it. I disagree with some of the methodological practices of the current Salafi movement, not the theoretical Salaf understanding of Islam. I disagree with things that are prevalent, that are not found in every single Salafi, but have become somewhat problematic for me. The harshness, the exclusivity, the way they treat other people, I disagree with this. And being in America in a post 9-11 world, and the term Salafi is associated with terrorists in that country, and the term Salafi is not a Quranic or Islamic term. It is not found in the Hadith, it is a term that has its good and its bad. So, because the term is not something we are obliged to use, and because the term has been associated with lots of things that are negative, terrorism and mistreatment and bombings and, and harshness and, and, and whatnot, so the term is not holy. The term is not sacred. The term does not need to be defended and Allah will not punish you for leaving the term. But the concept of following the Salaf, the concept of considering the Sahaba and Tabi'un and Taba Tabi'un to be the best generations, this is something that I firmly believe is a fundamental part of our religion of Islam. And the theology that comes from them, of Allah's names and attributes, and of Qadr and of Iman, I have studied Islamic theology. This is my expertise in Aqidah. I have a master's from Islamic University of Medina, which is the primary university of that methodology in Da'wah. I have a master's in Aqidah. I have a PhD in Islamic theology from Yale. I know my theology, alhamdulillah. And I am firmly believing in the theology of the Salaf, of the uh, early generations, Imam Ahmad, Ibn Taymiyyah and whatnot. But the movement as it exists today has so much negative baggage attached to it that I feel that it causes me more harm calling to others attached to this label. And you know who told us the first time, who told me, sitting in his gathering, you know who it was that told me to leave this label? Personally, I swear by Allah, as Allah is my witness, I was sitting barely 20 feet from my dear teacher, my most beloved teacher to me, Sheikh Muhammad ibn Saleh al Uthaymin rahimahullah ta'ala, in 2000. In 2000, uh, June, June of 2000, uh, June of 2000, in his Masjid of Unayza, and I had the opportunity to study with him a few months before he passed away. He passed away January 2001, and he held a summer camp. He used to hold a summer camp. Allah blessed me to attend the last summer camp with Sheikh Ibn Uthaymeen. So I sat with him for an entire summer in the hot desert of Runeza. And in that gathering, and this is on YouTube, the clip, and I posted it on my Facebook page as well, but you can search it. In that gathering, and I was there, I didn't listen to it on a video, I didn't listen to it on an audio, I didn't listen to it on a cassette recorder, I was in that gathering. When the Sheikh said to us, that when you find the Salafis becoming divided and doing this and doing that and leaving the way of the Salaf, then leave Salafis and go to the way of the Salaf. This is what Shaykh Ibn Uthaymeen told us. I can't say me because it wasn't just me, all of us in that gathering. And it is recorded and you will find it online. I followed what Shaykh Ibn Uthaymeen said and I followed it very publicly. And I stand by exactly what I said. I never ever said that I left the understanding of the Salaf, nor did I criticize the understanding of the Salaf. I simply said that the movement as it exists today, the humans who are a part of the movement, they are not perfect. And I disagree with certain things and perhaps I'll write a longer academic article about this issue. But if you want to know my creed and my theology, it has always been the same. My creed and theology is the creed of the Salaf as manifested by people like Ibn Taymiyyah, Imam al-Bukhari, Imam Ahmad, and all of the scholars that we love and we respect. And I hope that answers the question, inshaAllah ta'ala.